That obviously didn't work. Hey everybody, good afternoon. So I went out this morning, did some errands, tried to pick up some stuff for nationals, you know, the little travel thing so I don't get pulled over by the TSA because I do not want one of their free massages. And I'm trying to go pick up a bike case so I don't have to wrap my precious baby in cardboard and bubble wrap and make all that happen with a little bit of duct tape. So yeah, that's been my day so far. We're gonna try and keep things interesting and later on I will tell you how to pack for a bike race if you have to fly. So stick around. On my way downtown now to go to the Velo to try and pick up a case to fly my bike to Nationals. It's gonna be a good time. Hopefully get some cool drone shots of while I'm downtown. Plus, come on, get to blast some Daft Punk. What keeps the planet spinning? Uh, the force from the beginning. I've secured a bike case. Critical if you want to travel with a bicycle. I ironed on a patch onto my hat of one of my favorite places ever, the Bicycle Nomad Cafe. It's, I think I overcooked the thing a little bit. I well, kind of burnt it, but I mean, I guess the pattern's kind of cool. I don't know. That's Clark. Say hi, Clark. Hello. Hello. We're going to dinner. Yeah. Knock, knock. Uh, hey, Mumsy. Oh, Rusey. Shall we? Yeah. All right, Just let's do it. Up the club, sitting outside, having fun. Did you, did yeah. You, uh, so just got back home from dinner with my grandma and my cousin, and you won't believe who was there. I wish I could have filmed, but it felt so inappropriate. Uh, I had dinner with Sandra Day O'Connor. She's super cool, super nice, um, really sharp and on it. Uh, she seemed super excited about what I was doing this summer, which is a super honor to have. So I can't believe that happened. That was super cool. I wish I could have taken you guys there. It just seemed wrong to uh, film that. And, uh, you know, I'm super excited. Coming back. It's 9.30 at night. I still haven't packed for nationals. I leave in, oh my goodness, uh, it's 10 hours. I haven't, probably not going to sleep. Uh, it's going to be an interesting night. But first... Time for the first chalk talk. So when I'm considering going somewhere with a bike, I consider four things. How to bring my bike there, how to bring my gear there, how to bring my clothes there, and how to bring my camera equipment there. So first, bike. Choose the right bike. This is Road Nationals. I only have one bike. You gotta choose how you're gonna get it there. That's this bag. Bike goes in the bag. Done. Bike goes in the bike box. Gets tricky if you have spare parts. After your spare parts, you have to remember that you have to take care of your bike while you're out there. Tools. Next, gear. Coffee. Kits. Need your race uniforms. Clothes. I think that's pretty self-explanatory. Something you cannot forget. Socks. Last, cameras. This is important for me because I'm trying to tell the story of collegiate cycling. Nationals is going to be an incredibly important piece of that story. So, my camera gear that I'm bringing is the camera that I'm shooting on right now, which is a little Canon point and shoot, a little tripod that's holding it onto my bigger tripod right now. I'll get a shot of this with my phone so you can see what I'm looking at. So that's what I'm filming myself on right now, is my camera on a tripod on a tripod. Yeah, I know, it's a little sketchy, but it's what I could make work right now. Then, I'm also bringing my still camera. My still camera is to try and catch actually good photography. So that's what I'm bringing for camera gear. How do I bring this much stuff? Backpacks. I hate rolly bags. I think they're an unintelligent, extremely frustrating way to carry stuff through an airport. They flop all over the place. You cannot look cool rolling a bag. 
They do not work anywhere but in the airport. And let's be real, you're going adventuring anyways. Why would you ever use a rolling suitcase if you don't have to? Oh, Canuck, Canuck. Hi, Rip. Now, normally you aren't supposed to put cycling clothes in the dryer, but since it's already almost midnight, I think low heat's probably going to have to do. So as I'm sure many of you have noticed, my drone footage has always been a little, has been a little crooked recently. And so what I'm trying to do here now, while the rest of my laundry is in the dryer, is fix that. I don't know exactly what's going on. I'm taking it apart, I saw that if you level... Oh. Oh, my mount's bent. Just realized that. Hang on, let me bend this back. <sighs> this one is bent down. So I'm gonna see if I can figure out a way to straighten this out. I don't know if a hammer is the right move here. Yeah, there you go. That shouldn't be like that. Gotta figure out a way to fix that. Well, maybe that doesn't matter. Maybe I can just fiddle with this enough and get it to where it's gonna be level. Let's see if I can re-level this bit. I think I just take this plate off. And it's this pin here. Oh, uh, now I forget which way it was going. It was too high. I'm gonna grab some pliers. Let's go. I think that was the right way. Oh, it's better. Let's give that a try. Huh? Hey, hey, hey! Look at that. It's level. Er, it's, it's level er. Great success. It's 2.46 a.m. My flight board's in just under two hours. Pretty much all packed. Gonna grab the Uber and get going. So I'm outside waiting for my Uber. Uh, let head off to the airport. I think this is probably a good time to say goodnight. Get lucky. We're up all night to the sun. We're up all night to get some. We're up all night for good fun. We're up all night to get lucky.